So, we had a really nice time today at Mount Vernon. It was my first time going in the snow. I took great pictures, like really awesome great pictures. And I love doing this stuff. It's like my second life, you know. It keeps, what well, it does, it keeps me distracted from real life. So it's as if life is not even happening. It just, yeah. It's just like it keeps me distracted and as if life isn't even around anymore. Because history is a big part of me. It will always be a big part of me. And I'm glad that I have such a subject to be interested in because you look at these people nowadays and it's crazy. And you have me. I basically have the boring interests that nobody ever likes. But hey, you know, it's just something to enjoy for myself. That's what irritates me when people are like, what am I going to learn about history? These people are dead. Like, they may be dead, but... I like this, hon. If, uh... They didn't risk their lives. Uh, you would be in a total different position, and it probably wouldn't be in the one you're in now. So that's why you gotta love history, y'all. And just to see Mount Vernon in the snow was a awesome experience. I had to be careful though because of the ice. I seen two people slip and fall on their butt. Well one fell on their side, the other fell on their butt. The the one kinda fell he was kinda like that, you know. And then the other one just fell flat on her butt. So, it was funny. I got a few laughs out of it. Luckily, I don't know their names to, uh, call them out. It was such a nice experience. Of course, they did block off the forest trail, which kind of made me a little bit upset, but I, I can understand, because, you know, you got very back in, not bad, but you have very, uh, careful condition. Um... You know, you got ice. You got the... You just really have ice in the snow. So I can understand that. But I had a really good time. 